2023 you guys welcome back to my channel my name is d and this is the optimistic network this video was done in the festive season yes christmas season and not for the life of me i couldn't get it up just wally for technical difficulties anyways it's eggnog a lot of people want to know how to make eggnog but i know it's not too late because a lot of times eggnog is just seasonal so if you ever feel for eggnog any time of the year try this recipe I started with six egg yolk, add them to my mixing bowl, then some pink salt I use, and then a half a cup of sugar. Keep in mind, you can adjust the sugar depending on your desired sweetness. This can also be done with your hands, so you don't need a mixer, but a mixer make it so much easier. Shh, don't tell nobody. Now you're gonna mix this until it's creamy and you don't hear or feel any sugar grains. Also, don't be alarmed because the color is gonna change to like a light, to an eggnog color light creamish beigeish yellowish color now i didn't mention that this eggnog is going to be made with almond milk for all the lactose intolerant people like me and i chose the vanilla flavor unsweetened almond milk so one cup of heavy whipping cream two cups of almond milk nutmeg vanilla cinnamon and ground clove Oh, be sure to check the description box i'll leave the full recipe there i just don't remember the measurements of these spices that i use now this is a great time to let you know that if you're not subscribed to my channel what are you waiting for go ahead and smash that subscribe button turn your notification bells on and get active in the comments now from here just add your milk mixture to the stove top and you're gonna stand there and stir you don't want it to burn and you don't want it to boil but you want it to come as close to boil as possible and you'll know when that happened because it started to get a little foamy although i have mine on high heat it's best to do it on medium heat so no rush just make sure you're stirring if you're enjoying this video don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and i'm wishing you all the best for 2023 now once your milk and spice mixture get to a boiling point but it's not boiling you want to go ahead and stream it in to the mixer with the egg while it's mixing please excuse my camera angle i wasn't looking in the viewfinder because i'm dealing with hot things so i was being cautious and i think i was in the way so you didn't see the full streaming but you get what i'm saying just stream it in there while it makes on low or medium mix it on medium that part is extremely important because if you start streaming in and you're not mixing what's gonna happen the egg is gonna cook so it's gonna get quaddled so be sure you're mixing while you're streaming in the hot liquid now because it's mixing and y'all know how the mixer is it don't have a lot of space while the head is down and it's mixing what i did i just use a measuring cup to stream it in so that's why you saw me pouring so many times because i use the measuring cup but if you have access to bigger open space on your mixer you can just throw it straight from the pot after you're done mixing add the mixture back to the pot put it on the stove turn on the stove and stir until it almost come to a boil don't let it boil now what we're doing here is cooking the egg and it need to come to a temperature between 165 to 168 it can go over a little more but that's gonna bring it to boiling if you're not sure about it use a thermometer i didn't really use a thermometer but i showed you one then pour it in a bottle and put it in the fridge to cool that will be the hardest part after it's cool pour it in a glass serve it up just like that you can put a little cinnamon over it you can put a cinnamon stick over it so so good now this was so delicious and the color Color is beautiful it's just the lighting while it's looking a little darker i'm gonna see if i can add some filter without changing the whole video so it can look like what the original color is so yes i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't be afraid to give this a try this was actually quick and easy and it's a healthier way to have your egg now because you don't have a lot of preservative in it and the almond milk didn't give it any off taste this was just so delicious Again, thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in my next upload